have the greatest gig ever. So I've no. actually, I'm going into my 14th season in the NFL. So I play for Wait, the Philadelphia. What? Yeah, I play for the Philadelphia Eagles. Hey, John. Welcome back. Thanks, man. For those that don't know, John is an Eagle. He's on the Philadelphia Eagles. He's the long snapper. There we go. Then you found your way into this magic, even more importantly. And that's the other magician. Really? Yeah. Who are you here with today? My beautiful girlfriend, Where? Annalise. And uh, my mom, who's uh, my aunt, who is the greatest mom in the entire world that started raising me when I was 12, 13 years old. My sister and I went into temporary foster care. And my mom's sister, who's sitting right there, gave up her entire life, did everything she could to fight for custody for my sister and I. When I was 12 years old, I was at a baseball camp. And uh, my friend's parents picked me up and said there was an accident. We had to go to the police station. I was told that my parents had an argument and my dad was being questioned. I found out that she was beaten. My dad murdered my mom. He was convicted of second degree murder and then he was sentenced to 13 years in prison. Not only did I lose my mom, but I, I lost my dad. My aunt ended up taking my sister and I in. She went from being a single 32 year old woman to all of a sudden being a mom of two teenagers. I always say that the worst tragedy of my life became my greatest gift. There were many a nights, and still are, that we cry and we hold each other and just know that she's always looking down on us, my sister, Kathy. Magic was my escape. Magic was the only thing that I could do as a kid that completely took my mind off everything. I would totally say that magic saved my life. To have my aunt here at America's Got Talent with me it means the absolute world to me, and uh, I hope my performance makes her proud. So I'm gonna give you the stage. Best of luck. So you said you gotta make the show bigger, so boom. Uh -huh. Anyways, okay. So, uh, I love this. Neil, you're gonna love this. We got a deck. They're All huge. Right. You guys can't miss these. All I want you to do <laughs> is just touch anyone you want. It doesn't matter. Anyone? Anyone. Okay. Do you want to keep this or change your mind? Uh, I want to change my mind. You're that guy. Okay, here, just touch one. Uh, let's go here. Okay, stop. Do you want to keep this one or do you want to change I'm gonna mind? keep this one. You sure? Yes. I don't want to see it. I'm okay. gonna blindfold myself. Show the camera, show the crowd. Don't look. I'm not, I'm not looking, I'm gonna look down here. Okay, hey, everybody think of this card. Think of the color, the shape, the size, everything about it. And here's all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw this card. Ladies and gentlemen, this is ESP at its best. So far, so good. <laughs> all right, here we go. So when I get this right, this is so sick. Ladies and gentlemen, the card that everybody here is thinking of. Neo, the card you're thinking of, you're feeling it right now, mm. is none other than the ace of clubs. Killing it. Uh-oh. That, that, that's no? Not the, no. Uh, okay, hold on. That's amateur hour. You guys thought I drew the ace of clubs. No way. I thought I'd step this up. And ladies and gentlemen, right here before you, I drew an entire deck of cards, and Neo's card is inside. See that? See what I mean? <laughs> See what I did there? <laughs> Get it? No. I tell you what, this would be a good trick. What was it? You want me to tell you? <laughs> it's gonna help me out a lot right now, yeah. <laughs> Five of clubs. Let me see it. Okay, good. What if I could change that? Watch. Watch the ace. Five of clubs. I, I got the suit right, so I just gotta add a few clubs. Watch the ace. That would have been good though, if I could change that it. Been good. Oh, yeah. That would have been good. Honestly, that I probably would have walked out of the room and just quit because I, I could have topped that. <laughs> Remember earlier I said it was inside? Yeah. Watch. No. I there you go, Neil. And now look, I didn't want to do this, but look, just to show you, that five has been drawn on there the entire what? time. Oh. There is your ace. There is your five. I'm John Dornbach. Peace out. Does that make you a little bit nervous? Yeah. Mommy. Love you guys. Thank you. I see you. That's amazing. I'm showing you.
Simon, what do you think? I've said this before, John. You know, I actually do believe in magic. I don't think there's tricks. I think people have magic powers. Uh, you do. <laughs> there's no other explanation. <laughs> so not only you're a great football player, you are a wizard. I'll take it. I'll take it. That card trick was amazing. And you know, when you sit right here, it's like, I, I don't know how you did that. But what I love most is you. The way you perform, the way you talk, the way you make us laugh. But the trick itself is great. You figure this out, then. <laughs> That was good. Can I do something? For you, how's it feel? I'm speechless, man. I'm speechless. You're the man, dude. Oh, you're the man. No, now, you're Neo, the... tell everyone why you decided to hit your golden buzzer for John. Just looking at it, somebody might go, okay, it's just it's just card tricks, but I see the potential. I see what it could be. Should you go all the way? You might need a bigger deck, bro. You might need a bigger <laughs> deck. I've, uh, I've I've heard that before. <laughs> Thank you. Woo! John, you're going straight through to the live show. What a surprise! Yeah, that, uh, that just happened. So, that really uh, just happened. Does that feel good? That felt great. <laughs> that right there was one of the coolest moments that I'll ever have on stage. I mean, I there, know is, how I did it. there is no hole. I have no idea how that got out of there. That means now it's only okay, six spots. Only six it's left. From seven to six, right? I love you. I love you too. You. Oh, your hard work is paying off. I'm so proud of you. Thanks, you.